So this is probably going to be a two-parter. Uh, and, you know, it's basically uh, on two different videos, but, you know, made by the same people. And uh, all they say is, what the fuck? The first video I'm responding to is why people fear feminism. Like, okay, this got to be good, you know? I would like to see what their answer on why people fear feminism. I would love to hear it. This one's going to be very short, so I won't be here for... I have voices in my head, they counsel me, they understand, they talk to me. I think people are afraid of what they don't know. This is the most generic line that I have ever heard since any movie. Like, this is literally lines that comes from a freaking movie. I heard this once from X-Men, once in Man of Steel, and other movies I can't seem to remember. And all I have to say is that is just total freaking bullshit. Perhaps maybe people... Have, have you feminists ever stopped and considered that maybe these feminists, these anti-feminists, those who are quote-unquote afraid of feminism... Uh, don't fear feminism because what they don't understand, but rather what they do understand about feminism. And they most likely think that you're all total freaking jerks. And I think that the conservative movement and the anti-feminist movement has been very successful in promoting lies and stereotypes about what feminism actually is and what feminists actually do. Pot calling the kettle black much? I think that's part of the problem, but I think more and more, especially with the internet and blogs and Tumblr and social media, more young people are coming to feminism and becoming feminists every day. I think people who say that they're pro-gender equality but against feminism don't really understand what feminism is about. You hear that, ladies and gentlemen? If you oppose feminism, you just don't understand what feminism is all about. Uh, look, I've been against feminism since last year, you know, since 2012. I consider myself a proud anti-feminist, and I have seen the arguments that feminists have used again and again and again and again. What you just said is not really an argument. You're just trying to say, you're just trying to escape any form of criticism whatsoever by stating out that people just don't understand what feminism is all about. Bravo. You see, people like yourself are just trying to avoid an actual debate or actually dealing with criticism by stating you know, that people don't understand what feminism is. You're just avoiding any form of actual criticism of feminism. And I have yet to see a feminist address any forms of criticism against feminism. Not a single one. Gender equality is literally the, the dictionary definition of feminism. If you shut the fuck up and let me read my list, there's the fucking proof. And so I, can't, I obviously can't like... Oh, that so, number one, number one, shut the fuck up for a second. Yes, by stating the definition of a word, you somehow win the argument. Bravo. I think anyone who is against feminism but for social, political, economic equality between the sexes is actually a feminist. No, 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 no. First of all, no. Just because you believe in equality does not make you and automatically make you a freaking feminist. Sharing a common core belief is not going to turn you into a feminist. 
in order for you to be a feminist, you have to believe that the patriarchy is real and that women are the most oppressed group out of all the other groups. That's what a feminist really truly believes. They believe in the patriarchy. Humanists and egalitarians, they most likely do not believe in the patriarchy because the patriarchy itself is total fucking bullshit. If it's true that if it's true that the patriarchy does in fact exist, then we'd be sending women to war, we'd be making women pay for child support and etc. We would be op super oppressing women, but we are not. And besides, who would want to associate with a group who uses their own freaking gender to escape any form of criticism? They'll say that they're being overly oppressed because the amount of hatred that they receive. And it's because they're a woman rather than the fact that they're, what they're saying is total freaking bullshit. So I wouldn't want to associate with, with them even if they're, they're the only group of people who are truly fighting for each and they, and they maybe just don't understand what the word the feminism means, or they've bought into the sort of anti-feminist stereotypes. I think feminism bans men being apples. Gentlemen, not so much. I mean, I think part of that stereotype comes from the idea of being against chivalry, or this idea like feminists don't want men to open doors for them. I think men and women should open doors for each other. The negative aspect of chivalry that feminists have criticized in the past is that it's this assumption that if men do a certain number of settings, like open a door, pay for a meal, you know, bring flowers, that they are owed something in return. All I have to say about this part is fuck you. Second part will be coming pretty darn soon. But, you know, I'm a bit sick. And, you know, I'm just doing this during my spare time. But I promise you, the next time that I make a video about these guys, I will be at my 100%. And that's a promise I am not going to break. Until then, I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace. If you enjoy watching this video, click on the like button. Subscribe to this channel for more videos. And of course, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and ugh, Google+. We all know Google+, fucking sucks.